What's going on everyone? I'm back with another video for you guys. Today we're playing Murder Mystery 2 as you guys can see and today we're doing another episode of Murder Mystery 2 Secrets You Didn't Know About. First one did really well. You guys got the like goal so fast so let's get to uh, 10,000 likes if you guys want to see another one of these. This series is super fun. Pretty much what I do is tell you guys secrets in Murder Mystery 2 and Easter eggs and things like that that maybe you guys didn't know about because Nicholas the creator of Murder Mystery 2 is actually our best friend. Uh, me and Joven's best friend so it's pretty awesome uh, we, so we get to tell you guys cool little things that you guys might have not known about and yeah let's get straight into it you start code JD to support us shout out to everyone that joined the live stream today that was super sick should we do another one let us know in the comments down below and let's get straight into some secrets I'm really excited for this episode <laughs> Alrighty guys, let's kick it off with a pretty simple Easter egg, okay? So the first Easter egg I wanted to show you guys is actually right here, okay? This thing right here, um, it basically it looks like just a random little piece of gear in this map, okay? We're on Biolab, and a lot of you guys walk by this thing every day, but little do you know, this is actually a super secret Easter egg. Pretty much what this was is if you stood on this back in the day, back in Murder Mystery 1, this was the thing that would tell you what role you are, so it's kind of like a roll scanner in the new map like research facility oh uh, you know how you stand on it and it tells you if you're innocent murderer or sheriff yeah this is the one that is kind of like taken from murder mystery one and then it's put right here as like a little old easter egg okay so this was like a roll scanner and now it's out of commission just sitting here uh collecting dust which is pretty sad so the next little easter egg on murder mystery 2 is actually on ns office okay so basically if you're this is the receptionist room uh if you pretty much just walk if you guys didn't know ns office is called nickel Nicholas Studios, okay, so pretty much it's the studio that Nicholas made, kind of uh, the Murder Mystery 2 team kind of thing, okay, so that's why it's called NS Office, if you guys didn't know, Nicholas Studio, okay, so that's one little Easter egg, but basically, in the receptionist room, you can obviously see four pictures out here, okay, well, the first two pictures are of maps that Xylik made, okay, so Xylik made this map, he made the old Mineshaft map, and that's the picture of old Mineshaft that you guys remember, and then, look, this is Factory, that's Xylik's new map, okay, and then if you look on this side, this is a map that Joven made, an old, the old Bank 1, and then the next one is a map that has never been released in Murder Mystery 2. This is actually the nightclub map that we actually have videos on on our channel if you guys haven't seen it, uh, but this is a map that might actually be released in Murder Mystery 2, not, not yet or anything, but it's in the vault, okay? It's like kind of in the waiting, it's just sitting there, maybe might be used, maybe not, but that is nightclub right here if you guys didn't know, and it's cool because this whole map is like the NS development development team and it shows all the maps that were made. In Factory, there's two Easter eggs right here in this room, and it's actually two different YouTubers. Uh, one of them being us. You can see right here, there's a JD poster. That is our logo, and there's a little poster in the Factory map. And as well, right here, there's Mr. Zachary Plays. I believe that was his name. I'm not entirely sure if that's still his YouTube name, but his name is Zachary something, and that's his character right there. And he's on the back of the pizza box, which is actually really cool. And there's the pizza, and there's him, and there's our Easter egg right there on the wall. Yeah, so that's like a cool little Easter egg area. I love this little room. We're back on Edis office and we have another Easter egg here. Okay, so if you guys didn't know, there's obviously a JD recording studio in this map, as you can see. This is like where uh, it's a little Easter egg for like where we record, kind of like a little YouTube studio area. But what you guys sometimes might not realize is that this is like a screen right here and it's like only a one-way screen, right? But if you go over here, there's a doorway and behind that doorway, there is a mysterious Roblox character watching me and Joven because as you can see that's a one-way screen you could look into the room you could see the couch right there you could see people inside of this room through that door right here so if this guy stood right here I could actually see him through that door which is really cool actually look I see him right there you guys saw that for a second he was just sitting right there so that's a cool little Easter egg there's a guy spying on us there's a deeper meaning to this Easter egg and I don't know if I should say it in this video but I do want to bring up this little secret for you guys so just let let that sink in and maybe we'll talk about it in another episode. Some of you may be wondering in the secret room in factory why there's a door just sitting right here. It's just like a mini door. Like what is this mean? Why do we see this little door? You might see this thing come up in other uh, Easter egg spots. So just keep this in mind that there is an Easter egg little meme between the map builder Xylik and his friend a slouse or uh, I think they're a group of friends. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry if I don't know this exactly, but there's like a little Easter egg that they do uh, and they joke around 
around with this door. It's kind of random, honestly, but it's kind of funny as well. So there, there's the little Easter egg story behind that. And if I get any more news on that, I'll let you guys know, but I'm not sure. This is not really an Easter egg. Well, it kind of is, but I, I want you guys to see something funny. If you guys are in this map, I believe this is Office 3. If you look at everyone's cubicles, like this is Slouse right here. Oh no, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Bro, please don't kill me. I just want to show an Easter egg. So this is Slouse's desk right here. Look, he has no paperwork. He's just chilling at his desk. Look, this is like another person's paperwork, like nothing here. Uh, then there's, uh, look, see, no one has any paperwork on their desk, as you can see, okay? But if you go over here, look, you see Joven, this is his deck, no paperwork. Uh, 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 and then there's Xylik. Even Xylik has no paperwork. But if you go to Nicholas's desk, look, he has a huge stack of paperwork. This guy is going to be busy. He has a lot of updates to do. And it's kind of funny how the creator of the game, he has like the most work to do. He has this giant stack of paper, which is really funny. Oh, and then I died. But yeah, it's cool how all the offices have no paperwork, but Nick is loaded up. So yeah, so that's like a funny little Easter egg that you might notice when you're playing on the map. Sorry if this was a little bit of a shorter one. We did a long live stream today and that took up a lot of time. So I'm very sorry. Sorry about that. There will be another upload, upload though after this. Uh, again, tune in tomorrow. We're going to be doing another two videos. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. 10,000 likes is the goal for the for more secrets. Uh, again, I don't want to show you guys too much stuff. I got to keep some for the other episodes. So I'll see you guys in the next video. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for the support. You start code JD to support us when you're buying Robux. I'll see you guys in the next video.